Hi guys, this is a Tell After Three Nine, and this is my first video I've uploaded to YouTube. I'll create video tutorials for Windows XP, Vista, and Firefox. Maybe some programs. I'll teach you how to fasten your operating systems, how to make them better or look better, and all that. So let's begin. This tutorial is all about the best Firefox add-ons. It's this is part one, and let's begin. First, go to the Mozilla Firefox add-ons page. Now, the first add-on is going to be any color. As you see, my um, default Firefox theme is looking a lot, uh, a lot uh, different than the default thing because it's black. I have a picture inserted here, and you can do it too if you have any color installed. Now to install any color you will need a logged in account. If you don't have it, click on register. If you have it, click on login, um, import your email and then password and then everything will be okay. Now click on add to Firefox, um, install it, restart it and you're good to go. Click on tools and any color. Now this is the any colors window. Can you uh, you can use it to edit your default theme. So first, the background color. The background color, as you see, it's black, and it affects everything. So the highlight color is when you click on buttons, they're going to be highlighted. My highlight color is blue, and my buttons are blue, bluely highlighted. So the text color, well, basically it's the text, but it's not the side text. It's only the um, the Firefox text. So, but the best part is that you can add an image, add images wherever you want. Let's just say I've added my image here. If it's a small image, you can uh, change its position, such as this. Okay, such as this. Okay, here. I don't see it. Go on the top. As you see, it's in the middle, but I like it in the corner most. There we go. So, to change it, click on this and click on Browse. Choose your image and everything will be okay. Now, but uh, please advise, when you when you change an image, the text color is going to be by default black. So, if you have a black team, you're not going to see anything. So, I suggest you change the color before adding the image. This one. Okay, so, you can change the back side too. But, the back side is called the footer and the top is the header. Everything is going okay. So, well, basically this is it for the gear side on. Going to the next one. Next one is going to be one of the best Opera features. It's called Speed Dial. If uh, Opera uses, I would say the Speed Dial is a very neat firmware-like bookmarking system. So you click on Add to Firefox. I'm just going to uh, click on install now, restart it. When you start, there's going to be a window pop up prompting you to uh, check if you want to set it as your home page, if you want it to load in blank new tabs and blank new windows and all that. I personally suggest to load it in blank new tabs, such as I'm not going to open a new tab and it's and another one and it loads speed dial automatically. So it's very, very useful. Next, uh, uh, how to use it? Easy. I'm just going to clear this one. And there's two ways you can uh, edit a thumbnail. If it just left click it if it's empty, and you can type a site. But if you have a bookmark, let's just say I have a bookmark of Google, and I'm going to drag the bookmark into that thumbnail. It's going to load automatically. It's going to give you the image. Everything's real cool. So, another add-on is called Secure uh, Secure Login. Now, this this add-on is similar to another Opera feature called WAN Login, and it's basically the same. And it allows you to fastly log into your account by not need to type in the password and the username over and over again. So, click at the Firefox, install now, restart it. And when you start, you'll see this little key button. That means it's working. 
let's just say I'm going to log in into my Firefox account. You can either press this button or press the keyboard shortcut that is by default Alt N. As you see, I didn't have to even press enter, it automatically logged me in. Really nice. And uh, the last one, the last add on is going to be Juice. Now, Juice is a multifunctional add on. It's really awesome and I really like it. Click on Art Firefox, restart it. When you restart Firefox, you're going to see this window. Uh, click on Play the Webcast. Because the web, this uh, play web, uh, this webcast will introduce you to the most, y to all the features of Juice. Basically, all the features, how to use it. So I'm just going to show you the basics. Um, let's just say I want, I'll highlight a web browser, and s get uh, move it towards it, not into it, but towards the Juice sidebar. A little right. And now it searches for in Wikipedia for the world. So for the word web browser, it searches videos for the word browser. It searches news and all that. So this is f far not. Oh, let's just say I'm going to YouTube. Let's just say I'm going to open a video about um. Okay, U.S. elections. Uh, Reactions in Obama, or something. Well, any basically can click on the button, drag me. Now you do not have to drag it; you just need to click it. Basically, click it, and you can go to different sites, browse anywhere, and you can watch that video by doing anything else in the internet. It's really cool, and I really like it. So basically that's it. These are all the four add-ons I like it. Their links are given in the will be given in the description. Don't worry. Oh, another thing I want to uh, thank is Geeky Artist. He inspired me to do these videos. He's my YouTube partner. I really want to thank him and well, all that. So right comment and subscribe if you like my videos. So this was the Tower 59. See you guys.